Yeah, the pastor's been um, been been um, been beating me pretty well. Yeah. <laughs> in ping pong, but yeah. it's it's been good. It's been good. It's been a good um experience because yeah. it um. Yeah, I'm letting them yeah, win. Right. You know, you know, I'm I'm missing I'm I'm I'm, I'm missing the ball on purpose and everything. <laughs> It's, 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 it's fun. It's fun because he doesn't let up. Him and Brother Arthur, they both really don't really let up. They don't just give you the game. And that's what you want. You don't want nobody to just give you the game because you don't know how to play. And I've le I'm learning how to play by them playing. You know what I mean? So I'm enjoying it, you know. And that's one of the beautiful things about God is, like, you, you, you learn. That's right. You learn. Okay, you have an obstacle before you. You learn how to just stand there and wait. Until you overcome it, because you are going to overcome it, because God is an overcoming spirit. That's what he is. He's an overcoming spirit. That's the difference. Amen. So we magnify the Lord for what he is, and we magnify him for his mercy and grace. We don't, we magnify him for his mercy and grace, and we're dependent totally on his spirit. And there's no condemnation in those that are, that are in Christ Jesus, those that are called according to his purpose. No condemnation. Amen. 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 So I magnify the Lord. Amen. 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 I, I um, oh, magnify Lord. the Lord. I want to get up here and magnify the Lord. Amen. I was thinking about um, uh, quite often uh, many obstacles in, 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 in the work world that I've worked in. I've, I've always often come up against giants, and I didn't know how I was going to get through it. And then it w wasn't before long before I had got comfortable around the giants, and then I started to actually, um, what would you say, con contend with them? Like, I guess you say be on their same level, and then at the same time, in certain areas, I would excel. And it was, but when I started, it was like, how am I going to do this? <laughs> and this, this, this great challenge before me, like, I'm thinking in, in particular, um, I was working for this one company, and be normally, I never really had to always have to um, learn how to... Um, put things together on my own. At, when I first started welding, it was always a fixture or something where I put the parts into the fixture, tack it up, and weld it. But this one company I started working for, they would just give you the print and just say, make it. And then at, and then at the same time, they'd want it made in a, in a fast pace. And so what you'd have to do is you'd have to think of, think of a fixture and, and make the fixture and then get the job done all in that time. <laughs> and so, it, and so it, 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 it was a challenge, and I was like, why are they doing things like this? It's impossible. How do you expect to make money if you want us to every time make a jig and build a jig and then, and then put it, tack it to the table and then make the part, and then you're not making money that way. But, but actually, they're making money that way because they're, they're, it, was a, it was more so like a training. Now, and it wasn't, it wasn't written out in a manual. Like, they didn't give you a manual and say, this is how we're going to train you. But it was a training. It was almost like um, Karate Kid. You know, he, he made them paint the walls. He made them wax on, wax off. And he was like, what are you doing? You got me, you got me cleaning, and I'm not learning anything. And then he, threw him on the, um, then he um, took him out, and he showed him that he was actually learning something, you know. So, and, and that's how the walk is with God, too. You know, you, 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 you learn as you go. And so I magnify the Lord for, for, um, for his overcoming power because that's what he does. It's like... You're in a situation, but be of good cheer because he has overcome the world. So there is nothing that you're in, in the middle of that you're not going to overcome. You will overcome. According to your faith, only believe. Believe that he will do it, and he will do it. Amen. And rest. Rest in faith until it comes to pass because it will come to pass. Amen. So I want to magnify the Lord. Amen. Amen.